suspiks su spolius dėl išskaptų rūgų ir tada ateina per anksti darbą ir tada rodom iškart, kad koda, nu, tipo kodas ne, net iškart to nukirtam, rodom, kad jinai yra blato seno namuose. Tai ar tas nėra tai, kad mes praskitinam darbą? Kad neprodom labą darbą? Tai neprodom Elenos ir Godos darbą? Nu, mes parodom iš pat pradžių, kai kad ateimai darbą. Tai bet tik ateimas, sprant jos pradūrius įskiriai ir po to tipo darbo nebėra. Nes jeigu tai yra jos pirmoji... Tai reikia daryti tą pirmą objektą iš karto. Bet jeigu... Nu gerai, ar gali... Nes mes vienam objektai rodom, kad jis pamiršto raktus. Nu. Tai gal galim rodyti dar, kad kažką jinai... Kai atvyksta ofise kažką darba? Nu gali būti ir objektai, bet tada, kad kažkaip... Arba kad... Nu, kad tai būtų Elenai, kad šiuos išinės pažinimos su tai visą erdvę. Well, I'm a screenwriter and I work with different directors writing screenplays together or by my own, by myself. And I'm writing plays for theater as well. We met with Thomas in his documentary, short documentary project, Paradise Road. And we really got connected there. And then he suggested me to work with his feature, with his new feature fiction project. And I thought that I really liked the theme. I liked the idea, the concept. So it was the reason why I decided to join the project. This film I made, uh, yeah, when I was living in, in Stockholm. Yeah, and I was trying to meet uh, my kumir, like my god, uh, Roy Anderson, which I liked uh, then. Yeah, so I was trying to, to meet him, so I decided to document it. So I was filming without knowing that I'm going to make a film or it's going to be like long film or short film. I was just uh, filming my feelings, how I feel. Uh, being in Stockholm, in Sweden. Yeah, and after that I realized that it's really good material because myself, I went through all this waiting period and I decided just to make a film. And it's, uh, well, it's done and I think that's not that bad. And also making this film, I was trying to analyze uh, the city, how it affects me. I mean, how new city, I, I didn't know before, how I feel there what is uh, recognizable, what is really new, what is like uh, making me to feel happy or like surprised. So this new project is a bit related to this film. So this one was a documentary about myself and this one is about uh, other people and it's a fiction. But still it's uh, happening in one city. So, so I'm more or less interested in in the city by itself, how it could affect us as a human being, being like between the buildings or like the streets. Though it seems that it's really like unlive, only like bricks or, I don't know, concrete, but still we have feelings with those uh, things. So why it's so important to be in one or in another city. So this is what I'm trying to, to understand during this film. Ir po to, po kurio laiko matom, kad vis tiek tipo mama padarė savo, vis tiek jie sėdė ir neišneka ir sako tą patį, kad nu, aš nieko bandrus to neturiu. Nu, bet tai gali būti vėl, kad ne kinamė yra tas self-pit ir tada mama skambina. Taip, taip, taip. Nu, dar sakant, būtų veiksmiškai kažką veikti, ne? Tada jinai išvaro į... Į miestą. Į miestą. Tada tas vyras duoda numeriuką, išeina... Ir jis, man atrodo, nedar turėtų tipo to mieste kažkur matyti... Toj kavinį tipo į kažkokį vyrą kitą žiūrėti, kol prie jo, nu kad ir trumpai tipo, ar bandytų žmės mandatą, arba galėtų jo, 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 kuris atrodo vieną sėdį, nei vieną sėdį, žinai, bet tipo prie jo po toks šios prieina, žinai. Ir tai tipo ir viskas ką jinai išpešo, tai galbūt to vyro, lėvo vyro, žinai, numeris. Nu, ok, galim tai būti. Ai, ir tada dar yra tipo tas įtipo fone kažkur, kad tipo supažinai internet, tai nuo labo. Jo, tai gal reikia iš karto ant tipo periuką užrašyti juškį. Ką? Aš rašiau. Užrašiai tą, kad sėmė, kad ir mama skambė. Nu, tik tik ir mama skambė. 
Ты рассчитан, да? Да, по барскому добру был прачный стоит. Ну, это был с антрастом. Self-pity, тогда я был маскан, да? Мы работаем на фильм. It's one part of uh, of the project, the film, and we were working in this residency on the screenplay. There are three different stories or three different characters that are related uh, in one city, and by trying to compare those three different characters in their stories, we are trying to explore city and explore human fears and boundaries that they feel in the city. So we are very interested in complexes and boundaries people create to themselves and we are trying to figure out why they cannot overcome them. Yeah, and the thing is that there is one city. Uh, for now we think about our capital, it's Vilnius, and uh, all those three characters, they do not know each other. So they meet during the film. So it means that we, we want to raise a question like uh, how well we know people who are really close to us. It's like we live in the same city, we have the same fears, the same problems and the same like happy things, but we never think about uh, others who are really close to us. So, so we're trying to analyze how the structure of the city are like, I don't know, uh, crossing the people. Affects people and how yeah. people affect the city itself. And one of the most important things for us to explore people that are around us, that they are living today, and that the fears and the complexes they feel are like nowadays complexes, not like yesterday, not tomorrow's yeah. issues, but like today's and like our, that's why we chose like to make a film about our city that we are living in. For me, it was the first experience that I uh, went somewhere uh, for like some time only to work on the project without having any other problems or like studies, like work or uh, anything. And like, I really, only now, I, I always was thinking that it's very important to do that. And only now I realize that it's like, it's crucial to do that. If you're working on some project, you just need to, to go somewhere to concentrate and to wake up with the same ideas, to go to sleep with the same ideas and always to be 24 hours a day in your project. So that's the amazing opportunity to have th this kind of residency. Yeah, and I think that uh, to work, like working with the project we work right, n right now about the city structure, it's really good not to be in the city, mm -hmm. to think about the structure. Because when you are like in the city, so, so you are a part of it, so you cannot see it from a distance. But when you go like outside and you have uh, this uh, opportunity to have a view from perspective, so it's, it really helps, yeah. I think so, yeah. It's really good to, to be able to escape from the thing what you are doing, I mean. Yeah, yeah. I don't have any plans uh, to come back here, like to Czech Republic, because it was first time for me when I came to this country. Yeah, but I found I found this country really interesting because uh, I can see a lot of connection between our country because we both uh, used to be like a part of Soviet Union and so you can see in the people and in the I know city life that they still have this uh, post-Sovietic thing. It's not well. People used to say that it's a post-Sovietic complex, but I wouldn't say that it's really complex. But this, uh, this is a thing I cannot explain. It's, it's something it's like in the, the air. Tourists. You yeah, can yeah, yeah. in the people in the in their talk and everything. Yeah. You can. So I think that I really would like to come back because I found it very interesting in this country.